Sitting Bull showed himself to be a true leader and achieved the alliance of several Sioux and Cheyenne chiefs such as Crazy Horse, Guts and Spotted Eagle. They were meeting in a camp at Little Bighorn when on June 25, 1876 they were attacked by the 7th Cavalry Regiment of the United States Army, commanded by Lieutenant Colonel George Armstrong Custer. The punitive expedition was annihilated. In military terms, the defeat was of little consequence, but it was used as an excellent political weapon to justify an all-out war against the Sioux. In February 1877, Sitting Bull fled to Canada with 3,000 horsemen, pursued by the entire US Army. I would stay four years. The Canadian government tolerated it, although it denied its people any help. The Sioux had to starve most of the time, as buffalo and other species were also in short supply.